Hey there, everybody. Don Evans here from WatchReport.com, and today we have another unboxing video. Now, before I open this box, let me make this very clear because for some reason, even though it's in the title of this video, there was some confusion with the last video. So, uh, we've started to do unboxing videos here. Uh, it's an unboxing and a first look at the watch when they uh, arrive uh, for us for our review. Uh, the review will happen, you know, uh, possibly uh, a few weeks later, usually, is the way it's going to go. So, if you're wondering why I'm not pointing things, certain things out or only looking at, because I'm looking at it for the first time as well. I'm opening this box for the first time. I'm getting, you know, beyond images or whatever that are online, this is the first time that I'm looking at it uh, in person as well. So um, that's why I'm just kind of like talking about it as I open it and taking a look. It is not a full review. Uh, it's just a first look and an unboxing video. Um, so let me know what you guys think of these. Um, and uh, let me know one of these days, maybe uh, I'm gonna try and do one live. Um, Live videos seem a little aggravating to me with the way the the, the, the chat box pops up and uh, uh, you know everything like that. But uh, definitely uh, we could do a live video if uh, our viewers here would want it. So let's go ahead and open the Talker Chronograph up. Talker's kind of a weird name, I guess, but um, you know it's like TikTok Talker. Let me go ahead here and. See what we have. Okay, so pretty pretty standard packaging here. You got your white outer box sleeve, your uh, black cardboard box. So let's go ahead and see what the watch looks like. Um, it's under here. Warranty card under there. leatherette type of pouch here. Ooh, this guy, this guy's in there. All right. All right, this thing is uh, mummified here with plastic. All right, I got all the plastic off of it here. And uh, let's go ahead and take a look here at the Talker Chronograph. So uh, real quick, a few things. Um, design element, uh, definitely uh, Sin uh, to Tima style of vibe. Um, I don't remember offhand what Sin model this exactly looks like if you know uh, go ahead and leave it in the comments below um, price and description and everything i'm going to leave down below in the the uh, youtube description here i believe the price for it on the stainless steel uh, bracelet is 1450 or 1500 it also uh, comes on a leather strap and that starts at like 1250 so one thing i noticed um, i went to put it on the wrist here real fast and i noticed that the clasp is actually um, upside down uh, and what I mean is and unfortunately what I should have done here before I went to uh, put this on is I should have done a wrist check you know there's a certain youtuber out there that loves to do a wrist check before he starts his video but I'm not gonna do that here um, so I went to put it on and I realized that the bracelet is um, I guess for a lack for a better term, upside down, um, it's reversed. Um, as you can see here, if I flip this over, okay? Uh, so I'm going to have to um, uh, turn this around uh, so I could wear it properly and test this out. Um, another thing that I noticed is um, there's, there's no, it's not signed, it's not stamped. The clasp isn't signed or stamped. Um, that's an interesting choice. Um, I just think for uh, a watch of this price, um, that's interesting because it, it, it looks a touch generic. It, it looks a touch generic. Um, let me go ahead and see if I could, I don't know if I've ever done this like this. Oh, apologize. So there is, let me show you here. There is, it says talker right there, only on the uh, lock piece. Um, 
I don't know if I'm in love with this clasp uh, overall. Um, another thing of note is um, I don't even know if I'm going to have to remove a link from this because it seems, I mean, I only have a seven and a half inch wrist, so it seems pretty short to me already. I might just have to move a pin or two um, because it, it really is pretty close uh, to how I would wear the watch anyway. Let's go ahead, we'll uh, zoom in here a little bit. Give you a better look at the case and dial and this bracelet. Oh, you know what? Before I cut off this video, uh, let me go ahead. Let me go ahead and see if I could show you the case back here. Uh, take a look at that. Um, a customized rotor. Let's see if I can zoom in. There we go. A customized rotor um, on the 7750 movement here. Here we go. There's a better look at it there. So that's actually pretty nice looking. Um, that I did not expect. I had not seen a case back photo of this beforehand. So that's pretty cool. So that is an unboxing of the Talker chronograph and a first look. Uh, if you want to see more, uh, check out our Instagram and other social media channels uh, for updates on this and when the review is going to go live. Of course, subscribe here to our YouTube channel, hit that notification bell twice, and that way you will never miss another review and you will get notified when a review goes live or an unboxing goes live or any other kind of video goes live. Also check us out on watchreport.com to see our full website and read uh, all the reviews and news you would like. This has been Don Evans with an unboxing and a first look, Talker Chronograph. See you guys soon.